you. What up? All right. Um, so uh, we got another one from Patrice O'Neill. Hmm. Okay. 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 Yeah. Love this dude. Oh yeah. Uh, rest in peace. Yes. Yes. Definitely. He's legendary. Legendary. Yeah. The legendary uh, P- Patrice O'Neill. Yeah. One of the greatest comedians of all time. I yeah. think so. I think yeah. so. I think yeah. so. Definitely up there. Uh, so what we got? Uh, this is um, I'm not a racist, but. <laughs> uh, yeah man yeah man uh you know there's a lot of racist people out there you know yeah and if you choose to be racist i mean yeah. i guess i guess you can do what you want to do you know yeah but i mean i think all of us are guilty of just you know maybe just a little bit of racism maybe not racism maybe it's you know everybody stereotypes Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. I, 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 can agree. I can agree. Now, stereotyping isn't necessarily like racism. But, kind of. But it's just like stereotyping somebody's tendencies, That's somebody's like, actions. So what if I say this? Is this is this racist to say? All Asians are bad drivers. Is that no. racist or is that stereotyping? That's stereotyping. But isn't just isn't it just a little bit racist? I mean, I guess if the person okay, that's t- what I mean. I mean, if the person takes offense to it, but I mean, I don't think that's necessarily <laughs> a racist statement, you know? You know what I mean? I mean, you might not see it as a racist statement, but if I was like, all black people like chicken, is that stereotyping or is that? <laughs> I mean, if the numbers are there, <laughs> uh, all black people do like chicken, though, especially yeah. fried. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so Patrice O'Neal. I'm not a racist, but let's go. All right. How many people getting sick of the Hindu obstacle course at the airport? It's just, it, it's... Damn. I mean, I'm a racist, but it's, it's, it's getting... <laughs> and I don't mind foreigners, but don't be from your, like, from your country. Like, you, it's okay to be originally from there, like your parents and grandparents, but you can't be from India and <laughs> evil devil for my evil devil <laughs> ID. You go, what the fuck? I know I'm American. I, I gotta be more American than you because I don't go evil devil. Uh, evil devil, evil devil ID, boarding pass. Uh, <laughs> Man, I know my voice. I'm American. Like I need another, I need an American voice to ask me for my shit. But you can't get rid of the double day dudes because they're amazing. Like who else will work at a 24-hour Brooklyn gas station with no bulletproof vest and no gun? Uh. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> if they don't have less than a 50. I mean, double double. Oof. Double double double. <laughs> You can't get rid of them because they do jobs nobody else is going to do. That's why you can't really listen. What is this thing where we trying to get Mexicans out this country? Who else is going to work without Mexicans? And who else is going to work? <laughs> who else would drive a bicycle uh. on the highway? Who else would ride a <laughs> who else would ride a wait a minute? Who else would ride a bicycle on the highway against traffic to deliver you a panini sandwich for lunch? <laughs> <laughs> on time. Who else? Uh, uh, who else is gonna uh, kick in your hotel door to make your bed besides some little Mexican woman who has an <laughs> epic has to make your bed? I have to. I have to. I have to make hello, and she knocks and she fucking punches the door. <laughs> she scares the shit out. She kicks the fucking door, and the chain is on. Hello, hello, and you're like, Miss, the chain is on. I'm alive. The chain's on the door. If you don't have man, please. Lock, I, I, please, I must make your bed. I must make your bed. I must make your uh. bed. Please, oh, uh, please, <laughs> please. Oh. <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> I wish I never traveled. 
travel for real, for real, because I, I could, I would like to just never had travel outside this country, and then I could hate America and be happy. You know what I'm saying? But I travel, and now it's like I, now I like America, but I still hate. It's weird. I hate it, but it, it's, it, it's nowhere better because all I got to really deal with is racist crackers like that, and that's. <laughs> That's, it's funny, because like, I don't, black people really don't look at white people with like, you're the oppressor anymore. It's just something we do. It's just like, we like not liking white people, and white people like not liking us. It's like, it's just, that's just what we do, it's just. Because I'm not going nowhere, and I'll kill a motherfucker he tell me to go like, back to Africa. But listen, I'm talking to black people. Stop that fucking war shit that, go back to Africa shit. First of all, Africans, don't like black people. That's first one. <laughs> <laughs> they don't like us. And what the fuck am I going to do in Africa? Uh. <laughs> Besides fighting some war, wearing uh, sweatpants and tuxedo shoes. <laughs> with a fucking... to me you know what? what i'm saying like you know whenever you like call the bank or something like that and they transfer your phone call to, let's say like, like another country and the person oh. will be like hello thank you for calling Wells Fargo. my name is steve and you'll be like man i know your name is not steve you know what i mean <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Is that racist? Oh, I mean, is that racist? Me... It's not racist. It's, it's probably it's true. <laughs> it's true. Who's not name? Not Steve. He can't even pronounce it. Steve. <laughs> he can't even say his name. <laughs> That's not your name. Uh... Nikki. <laughs> to me but if it was said to me I'd be like yeah. what am I like going to do in Africa has an African never said has an African ever told me to go back to yeah. Africa no. no I don't think so why would an African tell me to go back to Africa now they do I, I have heard them talk about it as like the motherland and like a sacred place and I understand that I'm not you from know, there I understand that okay let's see grandfather's grandfather's grandfather <laughs> I don't know who, like, <laughs> I don't know, like, what relative came from Africa. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure. Ancestry. I'm pretty sure if you go way back, you'll find <laughs> a, a Frank Matumbo somewhere <laughs> in, in my family tree. Frank Matumbo <laughs> from Africa. But shit, I don't know. I don't know. Any... Uh, we're all from Africa. 
Yeah, basically, yeah. Yeah. But I'm just saying, you know what I mean. Yeah. Like, <laughs> me, this body, me, Frank. I ain't from Africa. Frank, what am I gonna do? Name Frank, a black dude named Frank in Africa. <laughs> uh. <laughs> 